Hello everybody, welcome to a new tutorial with PSD Box. In today's tutorial, I want to show you how I created this abstract portrait manipulation in Photoshop. This is something a bit more advanced. I'm using Photoshop CC 2019, but you can use previous versions as well. But Photoshop CC is recommended for some of the things that we're going to do here uh, in this manipulation and you'll find the stock images on the video description if you're watching this from YouTube as well as the PSD file and if you're watching this from my website you will find uh, the resources there on the on the page if you're new to my channel my name is Andre I've been working with uh, Photoshop I've been making Photoshop tutorials since 2010 and if you like Photoshop and especially photo manipulations if you want to learn new things about Photoshop and techniques make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon if you want to receive notifications every time I upload a new video also I encourage you to watch my premium tutorials if you want to learn a more advanced manipulation techniques you can do it here on YouTube if you're if you're looking for monthly subscriptions or on my website if you want a yearly premium subscription that being said, I hope you will enjoy this tutorial. As I said, it's something a bit more advanced. I'm gonna show how I made this effect here on the, on the woman's body using a 3D render and then just the regular manipulation techniques and light effects. So let's get started. So the canvas size that I used for this manipulation is 4000 by 5000 at the resolution of 300 but you know that I'm using these values especially the resolution because I want to have everything ready for print in case I want to do that but for this tutorial I'm going to lower things uh, I'm going to make them a little smaller first I'm going to change the resolution to 72 that's standard for screen and now I'm going to make uh, everything smaller half the size because I'm also recording the video but what you can do is just open the model image and then work from there now we're gonna start by creating the background first but um, I just want to let you know that I have the model already extracted from the background and I'm, I'm gonna give you the PSD file with the model already extracted you can see that I just brushed uh, a little around the hair because I don't want to spend time showing you how to extract this It's really simple using any extraction method that you like um, on my YouTube channel I have tutorials about many selection techniques so uh, what I'm gonna do is just open this PSD file just place it here and I'm gonna make her bigger for the background I started with a gradient I'm gonna create a, a gradient layer and I will give you the colors that I have but to start I just want to select any preset here that has two colors because it's easier to edit now the first color that I have I'm going to give you the color code it's 23 25 24 and the second color is 161 319 so just type the code here and for the second color I'm going to change the position by clicking this point over here and put it to 76 now I will change the style to radial and I want to have the brighter part in in the middle and with this gradient open I'm just gonna move it down here to where her chest is 